And I know Mr. Cookshong have been in touch with Caribbean Airlines. It's something we want to work on because this has been happening year after year. So we need to have a closer conversation with Carl Executive and, uh, and the, the, the sole proprietor of Carl, which is the Minister of Finance. And um, so we could have an understanding of all these events happening in Tobago, especially Tobago Carnival, and how best we could really sit around the table to make this thing work. In an immediate response, Vice Chairman Demijohn Cruikshank encouraged the visitors to head to the Port of Spain port if they wish to come to Tobago's carnival. I must commend Mr. Lyle Alexander and his team at the port. They've been doing an excellent job. So my message to everybody in Trinidad and Tobago, who wants to get to Tobago, I think the port is your first option. You should head to the port uh, because Cal is reporting 100% in terms of bookings for the flights that they have. And I also spoke to the, the, the officials at Cal this morning, and they gave us some stats. Uh, Caribbean Airlines did not leave back anybody yesterday. Everybody was, was taken, brought up to Tobago. Standbys and confirmed passengers came up yesterday. Mr. Cruikshank is pleading with Cal pilots to delay their protest action this week. And the bookings going into Christmas, we are seeing number and number of bookings taking place. So I uh, just another plea from the Tobago Division to the pilots, please. I know, uh, I know you have your industrial issues with Cal, but put them on the back burner this weekend and make sure that the flights come. They, they come in from the schedule we have. It's like every half an hour. Head of the Tobago Hotel and the Tourism Association. Alpha Lord says more visitors want to come to Tobago, but the air bridge remains a challenge. This year, most of the hotels, small, medium, large, and the villa sector, I think are reporting figures in the vicinity of 75% and higher, which is a significant improvement on the last two years. Um, we still face some challenges. Up to this morning, I had phone calls from persons who want to come. I, had, I spoke with a band leader this morning. He have persons now calling him. They want to come because they're seeing the hype. They're seeing the thing that they didn't see necessarily in the last two years that says the event is on. They're feeling the energy. But the getting to and from has always been a challenge. Additional vehicles from Trinidad will be arriving via the ferry as most of the car rentals on the island are booked out. The chamber is also calling on criminals to stay out of Tobago's carnival or feel the full brunt of the law. Elizabeth Williams, TV6 News.